The last Richard family photos. Martin is eight. Jahar Sarnayev is standing behind him. Before, after. Martin's entire body shattered, broken, eviscerated, burned. Lindsay Liu didn't plan to be there that day. It's her last day. Crystal Campbell lives less than a minute. The defense doesn't deny that it's the defendant you see here on Boylston Street dropping his backpack in front of the Forum restaurant, running away with the crowd. It was him, star attorney Judy Clark acknowledges in opening statements, and it's him shopping for milk at Whole Foods 20 minutes later. But Clark argues in the plot to leave a path of destruction, Tamerlan leads, Jahar follows. Tamerlan heads toward the finish line, then the first blast. Twelve seconds later, heads turn the second blast. Two months before the bombing, prosecutors say Jahar borrows a gun from his friend, the same 9mm Ruger used to kill Officer Sean Collier. Officer down. Surveillance video captures two men on the MIT campus approaching his squad car and taking off. The gun is used again later that night, prosecutors say, when 56 shots are fired at Watertown police. The firefight ends with Tamerlan dropping his gun, heading into a hail of bullets. Jahar driving over his brother's body before abandoning the Mercedes and hiding out in a dry docked boat. The words he etched, stop killing our innocent people and we will stop. The note he wrote, bloodstained, bullet riddled, we Muslims are one body, you hurt one, you hurt us all. Proof, according to prosecutors, that they felt they were soldiers, they were Mujahideen and Boston was their target. 